Exercise is very really good. It improves my breath, my physical stamina, and my muscles. And at the same time, it is good for my psychology. So it, it, it works both ways. Welcome to today's show. Now, as you can see, we are back at Beamish. We've got a bit of a strange request today. We're headed over to the uh, welfare hall with Deborah and the team. So you need a flannel or maybe a tea towel or a hanky of some kind. If you don't have one, don't panic. We're going to do some hand and wrist exercises today. So today we're going to be doing some exercises to work on our hands. Um, I think sometimes we forget about exercising our hands. We tend to concentrate on our arms and our legs. So we're going to show you some exercises that are going to help to strengthen up your grip. Now, we're going to be using something like this today. These are just some old cloths that we've got. Um, but you can use anything. You can use a dishcloth, a duster or a tea towel. If you haven't got anything like this, don't worry. You can have a look at Hassan. Hassan's going to show you that you can still do the exercises without a cloth. Okay, if you've got something to hand, the first thing that you're gonna to want to do is roll them up. So we're just gonna make a nice, tight sausage shape with our cloths. So you've got something like this. Right, so first of all, grip one side of your cloth with one hand and then bring the other one together. So this one is just, all we're gonna do is squeeze the hands. So imagine you're wringing the water out of your dishcloth and we're just going to work it along, squeeze, 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 until you get to one side. Then bring your hand close together and squeeze, 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 until you get to the other side. And as you can see, like Hassan's doing, it doesn't matter if you don't have one of these, you can do the same squeezy exercise without the cloth. And let's try that one more time. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Okay. Now bring your hands into the center. And again, just like we're wringing out a dishcloth, we're gonna take one hand forward and one hand back. So we're gonna twist it. And then we're gonna go the other way. So you can see one wrist goes up and one, one wrist goes down. So not too far, if you feel any uncomfortable feelings, any aches or pains, just stop. You're just going one way and then the other way. Okay. Now turn your cloth sideways, and this time we're going to put one hand on top of the other. So we want those hands to be touching, and we're just going to relax the shoulders, elbows out nice and wide, and the first move we're going to do is bringing the elbows together. So if you watch my hands, my hands are going to twist, and as I twist my hands, my elbows come together. So we're going to squeeze those elbows, get them as tight as we can, and you should feel that across your chest. Then loosen it, and bring your elbows really wide. There we go, can everybody feel that? Squeeze them in and out. So we're going to keep a tight hold of that cloth. Elbows come in, squeeze, 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 and take it out. Now hold it here, just relax the hands again. This time we're going to do a big pull. So this one is a really good exercise for if we're lifting heavy objects, like a heavy pan. So we're going to try and separate our hands. We're going to pull as hard as we can. One goes up, and one goes down. If you don't have a cloth, you just need to sort of really squeeze those arms and keep them nice and tight. And relax, let's loosen that off. And let's do that again, pull, pull, pull. As hard as you can, keep going, keep going, keep going. And relax, can you feel that in your shoulders? Yeah, so let's try that on the other side. One hand up and one hand down. So the first exercise is bringing those hands together. So we let the hands swivel around, the elbows come in, squeeze them tight and out, and one more time, squeeze them tight, and relax. Well done, everybody. And that's it for today's show. Thank you so much if you followed along. Don't forget, you can fit those exercises into your day at any point. Just takes a few moments. We'll see you again tomorrow.